welcome to angular demo so in this session i am discussing about angular demo first thing in this session what we are explain about the angular course content first we are explain about the introduction what is the angular and when it is started what is the advantages of angular we will discuss all those things in angular introductions next typescript basics so if you want develop an angular application compulsory we need a typescript so in this session second session we discuss about uh, once we discuss an uh, angular introduction then after we discuss about typescript basics and uh, angular fundamentals and next angular default project structure and components and next modules then after data bindings and built-in directives next we discuss about ng4 then after we will discuss about in previous we started only components and modules so here in this session we discuss about multiple components and multiple modules okay next children of comp children of components so if you want move one component to another component we were using the passing the data that type of things we are doing in children's of component next one like cycle works next services and pipes then after we discuss about forms and validations and uh, routing and guards then after ajax and unit testing and rxs and angular material design and animations okay this is the course content of your total angular next next we discuss about what is an angular so in this session i am discussing about what is an angular first angular is a one framework if you want to develop it is in a if you want develop any web applications we need angular angular is in a one framework to fill the to build client side applications okay framework to build an client side applications by using of angular we can create single page applications okay by using of angular application we can create a single page applications angular was developed by google in 2010 that is an angular parts version so why we learn angular it is an module up approach like if you want it is a module approach and uh, open source it is an open source you can uh, take one anyway and next one reusable so once you write down component first class we discuss about the component right and that component you can use in a uh, multiple times you can write once and uh, use in multiple times and next uh, okay it is very easy to develop okay here code reusable as there and a default functionality is there so if you want date we have the date pickers and if you want the form validations we have the form related so very easy to develop this angular application what is the history of angular angular the first version is an angular js that is and we started as 2010 okay so this angular js it is totally developed based on javascript totally based on javascript next version we changed it as 2014 that is an angular 2 in this angular 2 it is a total different angular 2 to latest version whatever the 2000 now the angular version is 10 so whatever the versions are the total versions we are using and based on typescript okay next version is started in angular 4 and then angular 5 here some changes are there in the 3 is and missing okay in angular 3 three version is not there directly it is moved and four next version angular 5 and next angular 6 then 7 they started in 2018 okay angular 8 it is started in 2010 angular 9 it is in 2020 february now the angular latest version is on 10 2010 that is in started in 2020 june okay so in each and every version they have the some small specific differences we will discuss and later this is the history of our angular next 
free requirements if we want to develop an angular application so we need the html and css and javascript so already we told right the first version whenever we started in the angular js that is a totally based on javascript based so basics of typescript you compulsory know about the basics of typescript so that is the reason angular 2 to latest version they are using an angular uh, by using a typescript okay that is the reason i explained like that on first session the second uh, whatever the second session is the second second we discuss about the basics of typescripts then after so what is the development environments if you want to set up the if you want to develop an angular application we need a tools right so here we need a tools and node and npm angular cli and editors and visual studio code okay so node for if you want to develop the angular applications we need compulsory node so first you need to install node.js that node.js it is installed from 